Hi guys, this is Ivan Milenkovic speaking. You know, when I was uh, 16 years old, back when I started playing the guitar, the biggest problem for me was to understand how to actually use my scales. In that time, pentatonic scale was the big thing for me, so I was spending hours at a time doing exercises up and down. After a while, when I started jamming, I usually did this. Well, needless to say, it didn't sound at all like the guitar legends I was hearing from the radio. And the big breakthrough for me was when I actually started to learn the names of the notes on the pentatonic pattern and using corresponding note with corresponding chord in the background. Now let me give you a simple example. We have a bluesy pentatonic lick that goes like this. Now if the landing note is changed on that particular lick to match the root note of a chord, it will sound much better. Having an A will work over A minor chord. Having D note as the landing note will work over D minor chord. Or having a C note will work over a C major chord. Or having a G note will sound good over a G major chord, for example. Suddenly, one lick that I knew, and I didn't knew a lot of them back then, could be used in several different situations depending on the chord. From then, I started to analyze chord progressions before making a solo over and started customizing the licks I had in order to make them sound just right. Needless to say that this was my first big step towards improvising techniques. And if you're practicing those scales and you don't really know what to do with them, try learning the names of those notes, then record corresponding chords and practice a bit. After that, the reflection of your practice in your playing will be clearly visible. Licks will make more sense and you will feel satisfaction because you learn to effectively use your newest pattern that you learned. If you like this idea, post some comments and we can discuss about it. Also, feel free to stop by the live video chats we hold every day regarding numerous guitar topics, including improvising. Check out our schedule of video chats on guitarmasterclass.com.